You know, football season is around the corner when the annual peanut butter bowl has its press conference. A number of football coaches from around the San Antonio area gathered today at Hero Stadium to talk about the 10 games dedicated to fighting food insecurity. The goal is simple. Encourage the fans and community at large to battle chronic hunger by collecting peanut butter. Four of those games are on this coming Friday night. Bernie versus Alamo Heights, San Marcos versus New Braunfels, Taft versus Aguin, and Reagan versus Brennan. All told, 20 different teams are participating in this year's drive, and they want to surpass the 23,000 jars of peanut butter collected in 2020. Ron Ritterman was part of the inaugural edition of the Peanut Butter Bowl back in 2016 between Johnson and Brandeis. Now he's at Alamo Heights, and the Mules are thrilled to have the head coach that helped start it all. Ron and I are actually sophomores on the varsity team. That was uh, the first team of Alma Heights to get to compete in the peanut butter bowl. So we've been able to to grow with with the with the game, and it's just been really cool to see how it's it's grown and to have now have the coach who started the entire thing is really special as well. We're all competitive. We all want to win on the scoreboard. We all want to win on Friday night. That's why you know you play the game. But through that, you learn so many great life lessons. And this is one of those that. We're going to compete on the peanut butter side of it too. We hope Alamo Heights, or we're expecting Alamo Heights to collect more than anybody, either through dropping off the, the jars of peanut butter or through the donations. You can donate on site at the games or online for $2 per jar, either at peanutbutterbowl.com or through Venmo. The Peanut Butter Bowl Champions Cup will be awarded to the school that donates the most peanut butter.